Hello, 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 beautiful Aquarius. Welcome to my channel. I am Tierra Love. I am here to bring you all some messages um, in regards to your love connections, okay? Um, and also, we're going to see what your person wants to say to you um, about the connection, all right? Or in regards to the connection. Um, please know, Aquarius, that these are general uh, messages. They will not resonate with every Aquarius and um, every one of you all's situation, okay? If you would like a personal reading, please check the description box below. Um, you all, when I reach a thousand subscribers, I will be giving two people um, a reading each, okay, free, right? All you have to do is comment under a video and your name goes in a drawing, all right? All right, and for um, welcome to the newcomers and for the ones that are returning, welcome back if you all uh, previously like subscribe share or comment it under a video i greatly appreciate it okay all right so aquarius let's see what's going on with you all i'm gonna pull you all a prayer for the month of oh, aquarius we need all these prayers goodness okay aquarius all right, your prayer for the month of May. I am thanking God for your loving heart that encourages so many. But love your enemies and do good and lend, expecting nothing in return. And your reward will be great. And you will be the sons of the Most High. For he himself is kind to ungrateful and evil men. You can find that in um, the Bible under Luke chapter 6 verse 35. Okay. Um, life is too short, the world is too big, and God's love is too God love is too great to live ordinary. Okay. That was wrote by Kristen Kane. Alright. So Aquarius. Aquarius for the month of May. In love. Let's give me some messages here for Aquarius. For the month of May in love. This is the last shuffle. You got Medusa here. Okay, Aquarius. You got Medusa here. So, um, I don't know. You could be dealing with someone who, um, is maybe on the dark side. Um, Medusa is like everything, um, she touches, turns dark, turns to snakes. Okay, so, um, yeah. All right, you got the queen here, Aquarius. That Medusa could be your energy or your person energy. Um, this queen here, um, you could be someone who is intuitive, Aquarius. Someone who is pretty much um, curious about something. Um, a queen is someone who is um, pretty much stable here maybe uh, firm or maybe fixed okay you got Scorpio here so you could be dealing with a Scorpio you could have Scorpio in your chart here Aquarius okay you got air here all right so um, Aquarius is an air sign or this could be that you um, thinking a lot here maybe about this situation you could be dealing with a fellow air sign here um, or someone who um, thinks and creates okay got the magician here so this is someone who creates someone who is um, I was gonna say creative again y'all um, someone who can manifest um, someone who is working on manifesting um, okay all right let's see Aquarius Aquarius for the month of May in love Flash Shuffle Let me flip 
this over. Got new patterns. Maybe you needed to do things differently here. You're looking towards new patterns. You got distance here, Aquarius. So there is too much distance to maintain this connection. Um, you and your person could not be speaking now. Maybe um, you stay uh, quite a bit. Well, uh... A few miles from your person here okay could be energetically you all are distant here all right you got fragile heart here so someone in this connection has a fragile heart um you can be vulnerable and trust in this connection your fragile heart is safe here so this is saying um that you are your person um their heart is safe with you or your heart is safe with them okay got sacred sexuality here so this connection has the potential for sacred tan tantric alchemy which means there's a um, strong spiritual connection here between you two okay y'all take the chance here so someone in this connection is needing to take a chance you can't grow in your comfort zone stepping into the unknown is trusting the universe go for it okay so that's taking the leap of faith here all right and we got betrayal here, all right? So maybe you feel betrayed, your person feels uh, betrayed here. But if there is some type of betrayal going on between you two, um, trust is part of your journey, understanding that through pain, this is teaching you and others to love more deeply and in a higher divine capacity, okay? So you just take this pain and use it to help you, um, help strengthen you, okay? All right, let's get some messages here for Aquarius for the month of May in love, this love connection here. All right. Aquarius. All right, messages here for Aquarius. Got bad reputation here. Maybe you put you're dealing with someone um, who has a bad reputation. Maybe um, you could be dealing with someone maybe that could have possibly put a bad taste in your mouth or not. Um, literally, you know. Okay, let's see. Take this. You got wolf in sheep's clothing here. Okay, so someone is not being authentic here. Someone could be hiding some things. Okay, <laughs> this wolf in sheep's clothing is funny. All right, all right. Um, let's see, Aquarius. You got incarcerated here. So this could be. Um, this could mean maybe for some you're dealing with someone who is incarcerated this could mean that you are mentally um mentally overwhelmed here you could be stressed here okay um all right you got the happiness hater okay so there's someone on the outside of this connection who don't want to see you and this person happy um you could be possibly dealing with a Happiness hater, someone who don't want to see you happy here, okay? Or is just someone that um, is really not too fond of this connection, okay? They got thief here, all right? So um, this says thief, robbed, lost, um, theft, physical, or emotional, okay? So this could be uh this could mean that maybe someone has <sighs> could be physically stole from you or um emotionally here maybe uh, took advantage of your feelings your emotional um the high hopes that you have for this person or the nice loving feelings that you put towards this person maybe you're feeling like this person has maybe robbed you um of your happiness here okay for some all right um maybe this person took advantage because you had um 
a lot of deep emotions here for this person, okay? And you got player here. So you could be dealing with a player. Um, you could be the player, all right? This could be somebody who likes to play basketball, could play basketball here. Or um, this is a, a two-time man. MF, okay? I don't know, y'all just kidding. <laughs> Ooh, all right, let's see. Aquarius here. It's not funny, y'all. I'm an Aquarius, okay? So just let's just put that out there, all right? So uh, I'm not cracking jokes, all right? Because it's tough. It don't be. It don't be funny. But if you, you know, we just got to... Look at the brighter side of things, okay? Because it would be this person loss, not the Aquarius loss, okay? All right. All right, Aquarius. In love for the month of May. In this love connection here, give me some messages for Aquarius. One more shuffle, please. All right, Aquarius. that calling me mm. decline okay all right sorry y'all okay so uh Aquarius let's see let's get some messages here for Aquarius in this connection here got the knight of cups here okay um you could be receiving some type of invitation here um could be uh, sexual energy here between you and this person. I'm going to keep going. Got the Page of Swords. Um, someone could be doing some spying here. Or um, you could be receiving some type of communication here coming from your person. All right. Um, maybe you could, be re you could have received some type of information that maybe caused some type of up roar between you and your person okay Aquarius you got the high priestess here um there is a lot of mystery here you need to use your intuition or there could be some uh, things going on behind the scene that you are unsure about okay got the six of swords here which is Aquarius energy this is moving on transitioning overcoming some difficulties here um, maybe moving towards got the six of Pentacles I'm um, moving towards something that is a more equal give-and-take here okay all right, so I'm um, transitioning, overcoming difficulties when it comes to maybe some type of addictions here. Um, this could be you or your person. This is Capricorn energy. Let's see, we got Taurus, Aquarius, uh, Pisces, and Cancer. Uh, Air signs: Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aquarius, and Pisces energy here. Let's see. Right, got the Eight of Wands here. So this is forward movement, quick action, um, quickly moving out of this energy. All right. Um, maybe you're wanting to, yeah, move away from this negative energy here you're quickly moving out of this here whether it's coming from you um you're feeling like this is the connection is not doing you any good or whatever that may be um i'm seeing you're transitioning and um you quickly um moving out of this energy here and moving towards this nine of cups here uh wish fulfillment happiness and feeling content all right that is what you're wanting, okay? Um, let's get some messages from here for Aquarius. Aquarius in love for the month of May. All right.
Okay, you got health here. So, um, could be needing to focus on your health. Maybe uh, focus on... Uh, what do I want to say? Um... Healing your emotions, all right? Maybe um, having a, a, like a, let me see, moving towards healthy a connection. Let me see. Messages for Aquarius, all right? You got to take your guard down here, all right? So, um, now let your guard down. Take down the barriers you have built around your heart. It's time to trust yourself and others. Love is the true meaning of life, so be open to it in all ways. So, this could mean um, that if you take the barriers down that's around your heart, you could be moving towards uh, more healthy relationships here, a more healthy connection here. Okay, you got mindfulness, Aquarius. So, um, start rehashing or living in the past or worrying about the future. You need to seize every minute and engage with the present moment. That's all that matters here. So, you or your person could keep bringing up things from the past, rehashing things from the past. This is causing stagnation here. Okay, you got hopes and dreams. So, you need to re stop rehashing things from the past and focus on your hopes and dreams. Focus on your dreams with positive thoughts and intentions. Dream big and believe in yourself your heartfelt desires are beginning to manifest okay um you got this young woman this could be you or your person um this is someone who's possibly dark haired who isn't afraid to speak her mind she is very independent goal oriented and likes to feel in control this young woman loves outdoor activities here okay so um it could be one in action starting to take action quickly taking action here okay all right um let's see aquarius aquarius for the month of may what's going on give me some messages here for aquarius in regards to this connection for the month of may let's see guys all right y'all my nieces and nephews just came in let me try to hurt you up because they be loud my sugars okay aquarius you got weather out the storm here so you want to weather out the storm with this person okay you are wanting to go through storms hurricanes all that when it comes to um this person and this connection okay you got getting to know you here so you all could be um well needing to communicate a bit more maybe get to know each other um a bit more Maybe this is saying your person is wanting to get to know you um, a little more. You got soulmates here, okay? So you could be dealing with your soulmate, Aquarius. All right, got happy family here. So um, you're moving towards building a happy family here. You're moving towards uh, oh, manifesting um, a happy family here, okay? You got hands of time. All right, so wanting to grow old with you so you're wanting to stand and test the time here with this person you're wanting to grow old with this person or this is what this person is wanting here all right you got friends here all right so you could be dealing with a friend and you all are um starting to get closer here um this could be also a friendship here okay and you got children all right so children are very important here um Maybe you have children together. Maybe you all are wanting to merge um, families here to make one big happy family. Okay. Um, maybe you're spending time with your children. Your person is spending time with their children here. All right. Well, let's see. Let's get some confessions, y'all. Let's see what the other person wants to say to you, Aquarius. Alright, what do your person want to say? Oh, goodness. I feel upset. The person might be a little upset, Aquarius. Goodness. Goodness gracious. Great boss fire. Do I leave that? Alright. 
you are all I ever need. You complete me. Okay. So uh, your person could be realizing this. All right. All right. Let's see. Giving up and leaving just seems so much easier than to just deal with any more pain here. So um, your person could be going through a lot of pain. Um, maybe this is not. Oh, well, this is because, well, this is the reason why you're not hearing from your person. Maybe a person uh, just felt the need to leave and walk away here. Um, it could be that distance that came up before, okay? So, um, the person just thought it would be easier, all right? So, we got, it's hard to move on when I keep comparing you to everyone new that I meet. So, your person is having a hard time trying to move on, okay? And I want to reach out, but scared of what you might say. All right, so, I don't know, you could be receiving some communication, or maybe you won't because your person is a little afraid, all right? All right, um, so maybe that's your person that needs to take the leap of faith, um, leap of faith, take the chance. All right okay so let's see oh y'all before we do that let's get some messages of love confession is supposed to came out after the messages of love okay. well i guess no or oh, messages of love after confessions might need to love after the confessions okay all right, so you have here wait. The timing is not quite right here, so you gotta wait. All right, time apart, so some distance will help bring clarity. So if you all are not speaking, um, there's that distance again. This will help bring some clarity. Maybe you're needing the distance to help bring clarity. Okay, got put away the computer, working less and having more fun will help strengthen your connection your relationship so maybe both of you all has just thrown yourself into work and really it's just you know just focus on your pinnacles okay you got acceptance here so everything happens for a reason so um let's know that y'all okay got boundaries let's say six of pinnacles energy here so firm boundaries are needed now okay so let's put up some boundaries um be firm uh Cause I know my children and it's like I'm I be hard when I need to, but then I be real soft. Shoot, I'm gonna have to put some boundaries up, put my foot down. Not just when I get upset, but you know, that way not don't wait till you get upset to put your foot down. You know? Shoot. Alright, Aquarius, let's get a healing message for uh, you all for the month of May. Aquas Beautiful Aquarius Alright Aquarius Let's see your healing message For the month of May Alright Better boundaries y'all <laughs> Okay Aquarius So better boundaries Communication Okay so, creating boundaries requires self-love and discipline. It's not about you shutting people out or being unkind. It is about you telling them you care enough about yourself to create boundaries that are for your highest good. Clear communication is needed to keep your boundaries intact. Okay, so that's the word of the month. Uh, word for the month of May, I guess, is boundaries here for us Aquarius. Okay. All right, so Aquarius, um, I hope that these messages will be helpful. I want to say thank you all for um, joining me. Um, if this resonates, if you feel like it will be helpful, please subscribe, like, share, comment. I would greatly appreciate it. I salute the divinity in you all. I am sending you all much love, much light, much positivity. And I love you all so much. And I see y'all next time here. Okay, bye.